Hey, have you ever thought about living in Toronto? Well, here are some facts that you may not know about this amazing city. I was going to give you five, but I love this topic, so I settled on eight. My name is Sandra Inamato, and if you enjoy this video, make sure to give it a like so it can be shared with people just like you. And if you haven't subscribed, make sure to hit that subscribe button below or at the bottom right of the screen. If you'd like to book a chat with me to discuss the Toronto real estate market, make sure to click the first link in the bio and choose a time that works best for you. So let's get started. First of all, Toronto is a diverse city. Toronto is one of the most multicultural cities in the world. Over half of its population was born outside of Canada, which offers a, a, us a variety of cultures and languages. More than 200 distinct ethnic origins are represented in this city, leading to a vibrant and diverse community. The Underground Path Network. Toronto is home to the world's largest underground pedestrian network, known as the Path, spanning over 30 kilometers and connecting various buildings and attractions in the downtown core. The Path is a bustling labyrinth of walkways, shops, restaurants, and services. It's especially popular during the winter months as it provides a climate-controlled escape from the cold. Castle Loma's Secret Tunnels. Castle Loma is a magnificent castle-like mansion in Toronto that was built by Sir Henry Pellet in the early 20th century. What many people don't know is that underneath the castle, there are secret tunnels that were intended to connect various parts of the estate. Unfortunately, financial issues prevented most of the tunnel's completion, but some can still be explored by visitors today. Number four, Toronto Islands were once a peninsula. Did you know that the Toronto Islands, a popular recreational area and escape from the city's hustle and bustle, were not always islands? Until a massive storm in 1858, the area was a connected peninsula. The storm created a channel that separated the islands from the mainland, resulting in the archipelago we know today. Number five, the distillery district. The distillery district is a trendy and historic neighborhood in Toronto known for its Victorian era industrial buildings. Once a renowned distillery producing whiskey, the area has now been transformed into a cultural hotspot with art galleries, restaurants, shops, and a unique atmosphere. Number six, the St. Lawrence Market. Recognized by National Geographic as the world's best food market, St. Lawrence Market is a food lover's paradise. The market's been operating since the early 19th century and offers a wide array of fresh produce, meats, cheeses, and artisanal foods. Number seven, the Kensington Market. Located in the heart of downtown Toronto, Kensington Market is a vibrant and diverse neighborhood known for its eclectic mix of vintage stores, ethnic eateries, and vibrant street art. It's a hub for artists, musicians, and a melting pot of cultures. And number eight, first Chinatown in North America. Toronto's Chinatown is one of the oldest in all of North America, established in the late 19th century. It's a bustling neighborhood filled with Chinese restaurants, shops, cultural attractions, offering visitor, visitors a taste of Chinese traditions and cuisine. You gotta try the dim sum. What are some of the things you'd like to know about the city of Toronto or the Toronto real estate market? Let us know in the comments and don't forget to like and subscribe. Bye for now.